In Young Sheldon Season 7 Episode 6, Georgie instantly refutes Sheldon's assumption that he is his brother's best man. Young Sheldon Season 7 took a mini break due to March Madness, leaving fans waiting for a new release for the final two weeks. Fortunately, it appears like CBS is making the lengthy wait worthwhile because Georgie and Mandy will finally begin getting ready for their wedding in the next Young Sheldon episode. The official teaser for Young Sheldon Season 7, Episode 6, Baptists, Catholics, and an Attempted Drowning, which CBS releases ahead of the outing, shows Sheldon assuming he will be his brother's best man, but Georgie quickly declines. In another scene, Mary enthusiastically announces that Georgie and Mandy's wedding preparations have begun. Sheldon isn't the only person having problems in the next Young Sheldon Season 7 episode, according to previously disclosed details. Additionally, Mary will go off against Audrey McAllister, Mandy's mother. It makes reasonable that Georgie would wait to designate the younger Cooper as his best man, given how unpleasant Sheldon has been lately and his growing distance from the Cooper family. It doesn't help that Sheldon's existence early in young Sheldon caused his older brother's life to be sad. Manny's response demonstrates just how absurd it is for the boy genius to even think he will play such a significant part in the nuptials. Having said that, more investigation reveals that it seems that Georgia has no other option for his best man. Young Sheldon is a family show, in contrast to The Big Bang Theory, which concentrated on the strength of friendship and the social support system, with the Pasadena gang supporting Sheldon. Surprisingly, the only person in the series with friends is the boy genius, despite being meant to be socially awkward. Although the prequel never truly depicts them, Missy has been making references to a few of her contemporaries. Georgie's storyline, meanwhile, has largely focused on his romantic life. Sheldon is the only person who can fill the role, unless he intends to choose Dale his best man. The first photo from Georgie and Mandy's young Sheldon wedding makes Sheldon's absence from the event official. It's not clear why he's not there, and more significantly, it's not clear why the Coopers would even consider going ahead with the celebration without Sheldon. Sheldon may be obnoxious, but he's still part of the family. It's also one of the last occasions they may commemorate as a group. Georgie made his Big Bang Theory debut a few years later, right before Sheldon marries Amy. Sheldon's brother didn't travel to Pasadena until much later in the Sikkim's run, unlike Missy and Mary, who both made appearances in the initial season of the nerd-focused comedy. As it happened, the two got into a fight over Sheldon's lack of awareness of Georgie's sacrifices made for their family after George passed away. They would not have made amends if Mary hadn't insisted on it. Even though Georgie did show up for Sheldon's wedding, he didn't participate much in the proceedings. Sheldon went with Leonard for the part rather than his brother. This made sense in the context of the Big Bang Theory, because Johnny Galecki was practically Sheldon's keeper for the majority of the show's run. It's interesting to note, though, whether Sheldon's choice to not at least question his brother about the situation was influenced by Georgie's rejection to have him serve as best man at his wedding to Mandy. Just for the record, a few seasons prior, Leonard married Penny and Sheldon was his best man. There were rumors that CBS was planning to save Georgie and Mandy's wedding for their follow-up program before it was officially announced that the two would tie the knot in young Sheldon. Sheldon and the Coopers' story will conclude in Medford, Texas, but George and Mary's firstborn son's journey will not end there. He and his wife will have to deal with the highs and lows of raising a child. The Young Sheldon sequel series, which presently has no title, will premiere on CBS in 2024 to 2025 as part of the TV slate. Unlike its parent program, which is a single camera project, this one will have many cameras. One may argue that having Georgie and Mandy's wedding take place in Young Sheldon is a far better storyline. It permits George, who is certain to pass away at some point in the remaining episodes of the Big Bang Theory prequel, to still be a part of the event. Additionally, there is a wonderful payoff to the couple's romance that began in Young Sheldon by doing this. Thirdly, the occasion follows the same pattern as many of their other significant occasions, such as their first date, meet cute, and baby Cece's birth. Ultimately, it provides the Coopers with an additional cause for joy before to young Sheldon's conclusion.